For this project, you will need a box, white piece of paper, some scissors, a pen, a tack, some tape, and some tin foil. The first step is to take the bottom of your box and trace it on the white piece of paper. Uh, make sure you get all four sides because then what we're going to do is cut it out. So cut along all the edges and then you're just going to place that in the bottom of the box. If you've cut it correctly, you should not need any tape. Next, we're going to cut out the two holes on the top of the box. So you're going to want them to be a fairly decent size like you can see here. And then we'll just tape the middle to hold that piece in place. The next step was to take some of your tin foil and place it over one side of the hole. So it doesn't matter which side you tape it on, you just need one of the holes to be covered with tin foil. Make sure you tape along the edges so that it doesn't fall off. The last step is to take your push pin and poke a hole. Now you want to move it around a little bit because you do want it to be slightly larger than just a pin hole. Now just line up the box so that the top where the hole is is lined up with the sun and you're looking through the bottom. You should be able to see a little white dot inside the box. This is where you're going to see the solar eclipse. I hope you enjoy this quick and cheap way to make your own solar eclipse viewer.